Hey everyone, I just filmed a Primark call a second ago um, and I also went to Poundland. I thought I'd just do them um, separate. Didn't get much, spent £9 but I thought I'd just share it with you. I got some chalkboard spray paint because I'm going to get like two of them jars um, with the lids to put in my bathroom because I'm very limited with space and it's I'm hoping to clear out a whole drawer because I actually want to get rid of the drawers or I'm going to need the drawer space for the baby so I'm going to put all my because you know obviously if you've watched me for a while I like to stock up on them white toothbrushes so I've all, I like to change them quite often so that's sort of taken up a whole basket so I'm going to put all them in one of the jars my cotton buds and all that sort of stuff make it look nice a bit more homely because my place isn't really homely it's very tidy but it's not homely and then for my toothbrush and everything that I use all the time um so that it doesn't look sort of messy and it goes all sort of like grubby from the toothbrush paste I'm just going to spray one of the jars black I also have a sign that I want to spray and it, this might come in handy for her chalkboard which is sort of quite hard to to wash so I got that um, I found another one of these, but in pink. I picked up the gold one, Glittery Bay. I thought it was worth getting, um, just to stick on a cardigan or on one of her teddies or something. I found these. Now, a lot of people from America at Dollar Tree have hauled these, but they're a much nicer print. Like They've got the Don't Do Not Care or something like that, Donut, um, something or other. But this has just got Summer Party print. They've got this lovely blue greeny what's it called like a I can't think of them like a mermaidy sort of color um but yeah it's glass that's why I like it and I thought it's just so handy because it will stop spillages but I what I will do is I'll probably change the straw to just my disposable ones but it, it's great just to have all the time uh, in the house because it stops the likelihood of it getting tipped over and causing a huge mess. But um, I also saw these. She hasn't got any hair, but I really like the unicorn, so I just picked it up for that. And again, just to use to put on her jacket or, or something like that, um, or to do some crafts with. But I thought that was worth picking up. I'll give that to her later. She's coming back from her dad's today. I got this giraffe. I'm always talking to her about giraffes. I love giraffes. And I say they've got big old necks. And so whenever we say giraffe, she always goes, mm, like my neck is quite long, actually. <laughs> uh, typical, could I look any more like a scarecrow? <laughs> I got that. I just thought it was fun. I got some of these honey roasted cashews because I was hungry. And I thought, what can I munch on that's actually going to feed the baby? Um, as well as fill me up because I just feel guilty when I'm pregnant about eating things unless it's beneficial for the baby I mean I don't know this might have all sorts of extra stuff in it that's not good probably but yeah I thought River might like these honey roasted cashews and then I also saw sesame caramel nuts and they reminded me of the ones that you get where they're like warm when you go out to like Portobello or Camden or like places like Tower Bridge and it smells really nice. I've had them before and Louis got me them. Expensive light, but they were nice. And I got some of these large double zipper freezer bags, um, 20 in a pack, because I'm bagging up all of her clothes um, and I'm going to need to put the sets in a bag so um, to sell at the car boot. I've gone through all the stuff I want to keep, which is quite a lot actually. I was hoping to just get rid of it all. But when I found out I was having a girl, um, I thought I'd better keep some of it. So I got some of them to put the sets in. Um, and then I also got myself a big box of poppets, <laughs> which ended up eating instead of the nuts. So didn't do so well, but I will try and get something substantial down there. I've had a neck train, but I just feel really guilty. Um, but yeah, that's it. Not much. Hope you're all doing well. Thanks for watching. And I will speak to you soon. Bye, everyone.